Hey, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Scott. And it's your boy J Mac who's doing some interpretive dance. I don't know what you call that. These are the moves that got Emily to fall in love with you, right? She didn't say anything. That's true. So that's a no. But right now, you're standing next to me. Technically I'm sitting, but hey, you know, whatever. It's gonna it's gonna make more sense because the music will be in the intro. But here we are. This I, somehow they just now released this, even though this was a month or almost two months ago. The Jungkook Usher conglomerate huh? of amazingness that happened with the Usher yeah, remix. Like the, the remix too. was oh. the remix caught me off guard. Usher's footwork wowed me. Oh yeah, oh, and yeah. like overall, like I just thought it was like a really cool pairing. Like I, I was I was excited, but you know military service. I told you. I told you. You have more stuff. That it's just gonna be not a flood, but like uh, not a trickle either, but like just like a steady stream. A good moisting? No. Ooh. A, a steady a steady stream of content that will come from the boys while they're it's like in you're in service. It's like you're in the movie Ponyo and when the sea rises mm -hmm. around you. You never seen Ponyo? No. Are you shitting me? Wow, let's everybody call him out in the comments. Never seen fucking Ponyo. I thought you were Wait, a Studio Ghibli fan. Anyways, how old here are we are. You? Hold on, pause. How old are you? Dude, Ponyo no, 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 almost made no, no, you cry no, no, today. No. How old are you? Uh, old enough no. to know your mom. No, I need not a politician answer, a real answer. I'm 35, Scott. And you just now started getting into anime? No, talk, I just saw talk, Ponyo talk, for the talk, first time. Talk, talk to me. Shut up. Talk, you haven't even talk, seen talk, Ponyo. Talk to me when you're like multiple animes. Jungkook. Dude. Usher standing next to you, the official video sketch, which we're here about, not about how you haven't seen Ponyo. Everybody call him out in the comments. Let's get it going. You can ask Emily, I watch this video all the time of Usher and Jungkook. Starting off with the walk off, so it'll bookend. It'll bookend. Oh, I get. Yeah, I, I see yeah, what yeah. you're doing. Cinematography and I shit, like that. telling a story. Oh, to Usher. That's dope. I don't want to smile. Thanks for joining me. Bro. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. There you go. You only get bro if it's like real authentic love, like, you know, admiration and respect. Right. It's so cool what they did with a fucking empty warehouse and made it look so dope on camera. I heard that this is the same warehouse that Tom Segura filmed his dance video. No? No. He saw him, he got starstruck. Oh, you see that go yeah. back? That was insane. That's real, that's real. That's real. Yeah, yeah, yeah I love that. They called him bro back. Yeah, 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 respect. <laughs> oh, Hell oh, yeah. Man. Yeah! We know the guy that wrote that beat. Yep. Standing next to He's like, oh yeah. Yeah. I base a lot of uh, Junko kind of being like, yeah, I'm gonna take your lead. Even though it's like his, his yeah. song, it's like, you know what? When you got greatness there and not... Saying the junk cook's not greatest, but when you got dancing rolling through that, it's like, hell yeah, I like your suggestion. Whatever you want to do. Like, yeah, bro. Oh, 
bless you. You know what? Like with his hair cut short like that, like it makes him look like so much more mature. Like normally, like we're used bit. to seeing him like what with, with, with the bangs and and all that, but like given like this, uh, you know, all the leathers, like kind of like that rougher look. Like he's got like a more mature look, which is kind of fitting because he's going in to do his service and stuff like that. True. So we had to cut it down, but. My man's is tough. Fun fact, when I had mentioned to her the other night when I was watching this, I actually specifically said, I fucking hate his hair in this video. I love it. Because I love his long hair. I'm just like, oh, he cut it for this video. I'm like, oh, I wish he had his little longer hair like he had in the music. Not that I hate it. It was just, funnily, I was like, oh, I hate his hair compared to what it was. But then I saw there was a comparison of him in 2014 compared to 2024. It was, or it was 2013, actually. Because they filmed this in 2023. Mm. That 10-year gap, it was almost the exact same hairstyle. So I don't know if that was something he was going for. Mm. Kind of going back to the 10 years, the, his original roots. Could be. It, so it could be that, but I was just like, oh. I, like, I loved his longer hair that he had for the music video. I'm like, oh, I wish he had it for this. But it does make him look a little edgier. I, may, I don't know if that's necessarily mature. Nah, to me, nah, but maybe looks, to you, but maybe, I don't, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, there's like a certain level of like... Of maturity, like when you cut your long hair, right? It, I mean, yeah, I mean, it, it's a trick. Yeah. It's a trick of the eye. Like nothing, nothing has changed except for like the length of your hair. But like, it just sure. made him look. It made him look older. Made him look edgier. I missed his uh, Reba McIntyre, nineteen nineties haircut that he had a few about a year or so ago back. We were watching him box. Mm-hmm. He had the oh, he had the <laughs> Zach Zach haircut from two thousand seven. If for some reason when you say Reba hair, I think about like her fancy video, and it's like just all over the place. Yeah. Anyways. He's an OG. That's right. And I, somebody made the point that, like, this is the closest we'll ever get to Jungkook dancing with Michael Jackson because Usher danced with Michael Jackson on stage. So... Talk about generational, remember? Right. I do like his Shawn Michaels pants. Something I always notice in the, the, the video. It's like they're Shawn Michaels yeah. studded pants. This whole video I've watched so many times. Even I know what like what the backup dancers are doing. A lot of what the backup dancers do in this video is dope as shit. They gotta keep up. to tell you so uh the main backup dancer he i'm pretty sure he's also one of the choreographers the main choreographer with the blonde hair watch this move he pulls you see it in the video but he does this thing where he goes in his jacket Mm -hmm. and like he pulls it out like a gun watch they show it right here watch that i like that 
He's like, damn. He's like, fuck yes. The coolest thing he didn't show though is when he does that chain flip. Yeah. That shit was dope. cover <laughs> that's so awesome for John Cook man and hey awesome for uh, Usher I say, it's awesome for it's, it's like kind of yeah. like a, a like an injection of like you know this is young superstar like you know I, I bet it's it's a prideful thing for him too like damn like, these young guys want to work with me hell yeah you know mm -hmm. I admire him nice Oh wow. Oh yeah. You're not at the Vegas. So yeah, it's kind of like what he said at the end kind of encapsulates what I've been saying. Like, he's going to do a service, but yeah. they're going to keep putting stuff out. Like, not to make you not forget them. Right, right. But like, hey, like, live your life. But hey, while I'm away, here's a little, here's a little sprinkle of me in your everyday. Yeah, and you know, damn, I, I hate to like turn it melancholy there and he... I'm only saying that because Jungkook said the word, mm -hmm. so I'll steal it for half a mo. Uh, it kind of got me there at the end because you can see on his face he had that realization when he was like, oh, this is my last thing I have scheduled. And he's like, mm -hmm. ah. Like, it kind of hit him. And he's like, kind of reflected there for a second. 
I, 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 you can see that the realness of that is like, like, damn, yeah, this was the, like the last thing. And what a way to like kind of, like kind of take your break and pause. That you're going into the military. And your last thing you get to do is fucking dance with Usher. Yeah, that's pretty fucking dope, man. I mean, talk, <laughs> talk, talk about a send off, you know? Yeah. Uh, like all, all, like I know that this song is or this video is about Jungkook, but like it seems like all the guys like before they left, they had like their their send off moments, right? Right, right, right. And we don't like obviously like we'll talk about that more like when we get into those videos but like this was like a perfect send-off moment like this was the last thing on his schedule yeah he got to like dance and sing with like pop royalty like he he got to do his thing now understandably you don't know what's gonna happen when you're doing your military service right. so obviously there's like that like that not hesitation but kind of like we oh, are man, going to like, the unknown yeah like you're just kind of like oh man i don't know what's gonna come next but you know He's already been gone, or they've all already been gone. So, like I've said in many videos past, like the countdown is now. Like he'll, like they will all be back before you know it. And it's good that they're putting out these videos because we weren't gonna forget them anyways. But you know, in the day to day, in the meantime, we get to share together. Because um, I see it in the comments a lot, like, "Oh, I miss him. I miss him. I miss him." Like we all do. But like now we get to share that together like in a new video right like, i feel like that's what these videos do they just bring army like closer together like a little bit more tight knit right right so it's just kind of like it's something cool with, with all the hopefully nuggets that they'll keep dropping throughout this time it'll just kind of yeah. keep us like keep us like oh yes like i needed that like mm -hmm. Like how Ponyo needed the love of Sasuke to, you know, become a full human. You wouldn't know because you've never seen Ponyo. You but only that, saw it today. I, do, I know, but it's you one of the top eight movies I've ever seen in my life. You, you only saw it today. And you only watch eight movies. I've seen way more than eight movies. I got more than eight movies in my life. I'm going to call a... I want to call We've foul. watched like eight Studio I'll, Ghibli I'm movies. I'm going to call foul on you. True, true or false, he only watches like eight movies on repeat at all times. And they are one, two, at least two. I don't have an off and on poster yet. I, I, I can't say for sure because we've watched I don't have a tenant. all of the Marvel movies. I've, I've come over six weeks in a row. I don't have row. a tenant poster. I've come over six weeks in a row and he's watching Oppenheimer. It's a good movie. Dog. In six Killian Murphy's in six, gonna win Best Actor. In six weeks before, anyways. In six this weeks before that, he was watching. Not Tenet, anything to do a, with Jungkook. And then six weeks and before Usher. that, he was watching Dune. And then for, we appreciate you coming and by. And for six years we before you. that, he was watching. Thank you for the Avengers being movies. an amazing like, person it is the, and it watching is the this. Thing Smile in the world. today. Hey, I love Lock you. out the negativity. Yeah, him. I love you. Go see Dune 2 out in theaters March 1st. That's not sponsored. You should just go do that. Anyways, we love you. So we can watch a new movie. Catch you on the next one. Really, never seen Ponyo? No, I've never seen Ponyo. What? I've never seen Ponyo. He hasn't seen her until today. I know exactly. Whatever. So I don't want to hear that bullshit. Next thing you're gonna tell me is you haven't seen How's Moving Castle. Not all the way through. Have you seen the English dub version? You know, it's Christian Bale. Mm, yes. It's How? We, it's the only one we watched that, without the Japanese audio. Oh, Prince, she, Princess Mononoke for sure. Well, she 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 played the. Uh, oh, he is in that too. No, 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 no. no. Billy Bob Thornton's a little. Oh, Billy Bob Thornton. Little yeah. big, big nose dude. Yeah, but we, she accidentally played the English version of Howl's Moving Castle, and she was like, oh, we can switch it, and he started talking, I'm like, wait a minute. That's fucking Christian Bale, we're keeping it on this one. That's it just added so bad. much. That's fucking bad. Batman. Good shit, right, Maroki? Mm-hmm.